Hey guys, welcome to Rush One Gaming. This is Rush One, where today I'm going to play this awesome game of Farming Simulator. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, check out this Farming Simulator, where this game basically allows you to do farming. Use all kinds of uh, equipment, tractors, and it allows you to plow your fields, sow your seeds, and basically allows us to do some awesome farming. Alright, so let's get in the game. Now before I get to do the actual farming, I'm going to take care of a few things. Options. Music volume, I'm going to get this low. Alright. Now let's go back. Now I'm going to get into the tutorials and uh, let's learn how we can actually do the farming in this game. Alright, so here we are. Tutorials number one. Learn the basics of the game and how to effectively work your farmland. Arable farming. Alright, let's get into this tutorial. All right, game is being loaded. Change your environment. You can transform a forest into fields. That would be absolutely awesome. All right, we're going to wait until this loads completely. And let's see how we can go about doing the farming. Sheep don't require much if they have enough water and grass from the pasture. They will produce wool which can be picked up and sold at the town's spinnery. Why not? Alright, here we are. Almost there. The game is loading. Alright, so let's get into the menu. Wow, this looks awesome. We are actually going to drive this tractor. Wow. All right, welcome to the first tutorial where you will learn how to prepare your field. That's very basic, isn't it? And grow crops for a rich harvest. If you forget what to do next or want to exit the tutorial, you can open the tutorial menu at any time by using the menu button. So, all right. So, I'm going to say OK. Now, when I press A on my controller, it is going to make me jump. And Y would make me crouch. All right. Now, first look around the area, then move up to the tractor packed in front of the cultivator at the edge of your field. So basically L allows me to move around, right, and then go right and go left and front and backwards. And then I'm going to use R to look around. This is beautiful. This really is beautiful. Look at that. Wow. Excellent. Excellent. All right. So here's our tractor. So I'm going to say OK, and then I'm going to move ahead it's a big machine isn't it but compared to other vehicles you get to drive it's still a rather small old tractor wow that is awesome you know what because this game will basically allow us to drive all kinds of farming equipments which are going to be really huge than this small old tractor all right don't worry driving this one is easier than you might think hop in all right, so I'm going to enter the vehicle. If I do an X on my controller, it's going to put me right into the tractor, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to say OK, and then I'm going to move forward before I hop into the tractor. Wow, this is a beautiful tractor. Look at this. Wow. And this equipment here basically allows you to plow your field. That's what I think. Wow, this is a beautiful tractor. Look at the look at the detailing here. Tail lights. And this basically allows you to 
fix your tractor to this awesome looking flowing equipment and you have something here I wonder what this is but I believe this can also be attached to the tractor Wow New Holland 8340 power star SLE fantastic so will this allow me to get into the road Wow all right, I'm not going to stand in the middle of the road only to be hit by other vehicles. So I'm going to go here and hop into my tractor. Say X. And there we are. You can hear the sound. Awesome. Here's the gas pedal mixed to it, the brake. And you have seen a steering wheel before, haven't you? Absolutely. It's easy. So RT, like any other racing game, allows you to stop the vehicle or accelerate the vehicle, I should say, and LT allows you to slow down and bring your vehicle to halt. Alright, so L basically allows you to steer your vehicle left and right, and then so say OK, and there are a few further instructions here, so let's read the instructions. First thing first, slowly back up the cultivator behind you and attach it to your tractor. Alright, so this red looking missionary is the cultivator. It basically allows you to cultivate your land. An icon beneath the tractor symbol in the lower right section of the user interface will appear when you're close enough to attach it. So alright, so this is this is the icon that is being referred here. 217 liters of fuel left, that's awesome enough to cultivate my whole land. Once the cultivator is lifted into driving position, move forward towards the small black weight and attach it to the front of your tractor. So this is the black weight right in front of your tractor. We are going to attach both of these, the cultivator and the black weight to the tractor. The extra weight will balance out the heavy weight at the back. Alright, it's understandable. Alright, so I'm going to say OK and I'm going to slowly back up my tractor. Alright, it's coming back. As you can see. Is it close enough? Alright, it is close enough. So if you look at the top left of my screen it basically gives you the attach symbol now if your tractor is farther it does not give you the symbol to attach the cultivator to the tractor so i'm going to back up the tractor next to the cultivator and there you go so i'm going to basically attach the cultivator so it's lifted and the cultivator is basically rolling now i'm going to Get my vehicle in front because I obviously have to attach the weight as well. So where are we? All right, it's close enough, guys. It's close enough. So I'm basically moving R. That allows me to give me give me different uh, camera angles. All right, so we are close enough. So I'm going to basically say A. The weight is attached. All right, so even more instructions great job so far now you can prepare the field before sowing since you have two tools attached you can switch between them in order to manipulate each the schematic view of the tractor in the bottom right displays the current currently active tool all right so looking at the icon to the right corner of the screen at the bottom you see that the currently active tool is the weight so we can basically switch between the weight and the cultivator. Select the cultivator in the back and lower it to the soil and then drive up and down the field as straight as you can. So when you do that, it basically allows you to sow the field or cultivate the field. Now, I can use the Y button on my controller to basically switch between my weight and the cultivator. Now LB with A allows me to unfold or fold the selected tree. Basically, 
it allows you to switch between your tools and ld and b allows you to lower or raise the tool all right so i'm going to say okay now obviously i'm going to switch between my tools so i'm going to do ld and a there you go now move a little forward and that is my weight Let's, 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 let's do this. So I'm going to switch. Oh. Now why my weight is not attached? So I'm going to go forward again. And attach. Alright. And then I'm going to say LD. Now you know what? I'm going to attach this. Then I'm gonna switch and then I'm gonna do the L so I'm dropping it. Alright guys, so let's go ahead and sew this. Alright, so let's get forward. I'm gonna drive a little slower. Wow, this is beautiful. Now look look at this. So we are basically sewing the field for cultivation. Alright, this is absolutely terrific guys. Alright. Oh, I nearly forgot. You can turn on the radio to listen to, to some music while you work and enjoy driving from a different perspective. So, LB and RB and then the radio. Alright, it's fantastic. You can already hear the music. Radio, yes, this one. All right, we're going to hear some awesome music and then so happy. All right, go ahead. This is fantastic. This is fantastic. I just want to make sure that I do not show grass. So I'm going to do it right until the end of my feet. Or should I drive ahead? Alright. Now I'm not liking this music guys. So, so let's go ahead and change the channel. I need some smooth, soothing music, so I'm going to choose the pop. Alright, so I'm going to back it up. All the way. I'm going a little faster. Wow, this is beautiful. Alright guys, this is 
Fox and this is really awesome. They're doing a great job. Alright, nicely done. You have got the hang of cultivation ready to plant some seeds. Wow, this is beautiful. So what we basically did was we were able to sow our, our fields, I should say. And uh, now we basically know how to attach the cultivator, attach the weight onto a tractor, how to switch between them, how to raise or lower the weight on the cultivator. That basically allows us to sow our fields. So now I'm going to say OK. Now let's get into the next tutorial. So cultivating loosened the soil. That's right, making it well prepared for sowing. So get on the tractor and attach the tools as you did before. So we have the sower. So beautiful looking equipment that would basically allow us to sow fields. I suppose this is beautiful. All right, so alrighty. So we also have the weight. So I'm going to hop into the tractor. There we go. Now let me back it up. Now how do I stop my music? I'm gonna exit my vehicle. And put back it doesn't stop the radio. All right, we will figure that out. All right, so I'm going to back it up and attach the sewing equipment. All right, so I can basically... So it tells us how much seeds are left. 700 of them? It's awesome. So I'm going to also add the weight. So let us move ahead. going to attach. Alright, so sewing machines need to be turned on before they can plant seeds, obviously. And again, you will need to lower it down into soil. When you are ready, go up the field again and sow some canola seeds. Wow! So we are basically going to sow some canola fields in this awesome looking land of ours which is, which is ready for sowing. Switch tool selection, Y, alright, LB plus B, lower or raise, selected tool, LB plus X, turn selected tool, on or off. Now, we have to do that because that would basically allow us to plant seeds, so I'm going to say OK. Now, the selected tool is the weight, so I'm going to switch it to the sewing equipment, there we are. So let's go a little French and then I'm going to lower the machine down. So I'm going to say LBMB. There we are. I'm going to turn on the equipment. Now the green color shows that your sewing equipment is ready to actually sew seeds. So let's go ahead and get started guys. Alright, so as you can see, if you look closer, it's actually putting the seeds down. Alright, so let me get closer, let me zoom in. Alright, but I'm sure you can notice the way I'm noticing here, it's actually sowing seeds. It's actually coming down. Beautiful. Go to the sides. All right. I just want to make sure that I have sowed my feet, my seeds, I should say. 
All right, so there we are. I think we are good. So I'm going to back up the tractor. Should I be throwing keys when I back up two? Thank you and bye-bye.